Hello, my name is Leonardo, and in this video, I'm going to work on the pre-flight check for the Prusa i3 MK3 printer. In my last video, I worked on the electronics assembly, and in this video, I'm going to do the next step. Let's get started. So, let's see what the first step is. The first step is to move the, the E-axis assembly all the way to the left by um, gently pushing it and also to turn the e z-axis motors so that it goes down and just just the the nozzle is just above the heat bin and don't turn the motors too fast because then the lcd will light up so you don't want it that now let's see what the next step is the next step is to move the extruder all the way to the right so I'm going to gently move it to the right. So the next step is to gently slide the E-axis assembly to the middle of the heat bed. So I'm going to do that. And then we're going to take a zip tie and we're going to Put it gently under the PINDA sensor, but don't put it with the head here, which is the bigger part. Just put it on the part that is flat here. Now I'm going to release the PINDA sensor. Now that I've finished tightening the pin sensor, let's see what the next step is. The next step is to power on the 3D printer and ca calibrate it. So I'm going to plug in the 3D printer here. And then I'm going to turn it on. Okay, so now I'm going to begin the calibration. So right now it's asking if I want to start calibration and I'm going to click on yes. And it gives me a welcoming message saying I am your Prusa i3 MK3S printer. So I'm going to begin. So now it's going to check if there's any uh, some assembly problems. So it's going to check for it. So it's going to test itself. So right now it's going to test the fan. And now it's checking the X axis. Now checking the y-axis. Now checking the z-axis. So right now it's um, checking the bed here, and then next it's going to check the hot end here. Now everything, it says that everything is correct, nothing's broken, and now it's running the XYZ calibration. Now we are going to 
them check the now we're going to check the enter the pot end here if it's too low and it's scratching the board so i'm going to put a piece of paper here determine And it's gonna check each corner. So it's going to, the, the hot end is gonna move a little bit. The, the nozzle is gonna move around. And I'm gonna check with the, the piece of paper if it's like dragging on anything. If it is dragging, you want to quit the, um, quit the printer process by clicking the X button on here. And that will like restart your printer. Okay, so now I'm done with the calibration. So now it says to place the seal sheet here, the one that you print on, on the print bed. So I'm gonna gently do it. And then I'm gonna recalibrate it. And you wanna put it on the side where it has this little bump here and the bump should be facing these two screws, and those two screws should help you align the print bin. So it should slide nicely in there, like that. And now I'm gonna calibrate it again. Now I'm going to load some filament in there and then test print it. So I'm going to open up this filament box and load it in here. Okay, so now I can begin printing. Thanks for watching. Bye.